<laughs> yeah, all I did was... <laughs> I wouldn't go that far, you. It says chew. Why? I mean, it's on the level of some of the other quotes in this server. This, like, weird shit like this is just expected. Yes, well, anyway. like, I'm, I'm not quoting it in anything that is, like... I'm only quoting it in 18 plus, so... Oh, yeah. Fair. Anyways, Hatchet, read your uh, line. Yeah. All I... I don't think Discord would like that very much. Oh. Oh. Okay. Discord doesn't like I, Alabama. I mean, I would like. Okay, like, I'm gonna add just, that one. I'm gonna add that one. <laughs> Discord doesn't like Alabama. <laughs> like, does Discord actually censor out like words like that? I never. Probably. Yeah. I guess it's not that far fetched. <laughs> I just haven't heard about yeah. it. I guess you could like. Uh, replace incest with the word Alabama. Okay. Just not anything too degenerate. Is that a dice roll you want to make? Eh. So it, it was, I guess, the real horror. Yeah, the. Uh. The real horror is the Alabama we saw along the way. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, Hatchet, read your line. You know what? Here no, I'm going to do... Yeah. Hello, Bama Lust. <laughs> yeah? All I did was weed out a quitter for you. I did it. I did it. There you go. Yeah. God damn it. Fuck off, site director. <laughs> go, go look go look at the quotes. Yeah, I see. I, I saw it. Oh, I didn't. Uh, uh, quotes and things. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> you got a big line to say. You're welcome. And I wouldn't harass anyone if you'd stop ignoring me when... When I need you. You always need something. You always have some bullshit crisis the moment I'm supposed to meet up with someone. Bet you bloody love it here when I... Where I can't as much take a piss without you knowing. And I bet you'd love it if... Jesus Christ! <laughs> I bet you'd love it if I auto-homicided then. Where did that come from? Ah, uh, fuck. What a prime example of your... You. Just you. <laughs> you would. You would. I know it already. I'm right where you want me, huh? We're on a baby hunt and... She says we're on a baby hunt and don't think we don't know how to weed them out. <laughs> <laughs> I really need to watch that movie again. I have it on DVD somewhere. I'll do it then. I can... I can, just for you. You know, I have just the thing for that. Before we continue, I remember in elementary school we were supposed to bring in movies we wanted to watch all day. I brought in that Spongebob movie. And the only reason they didn't allow it to be shown is because Patrick Starr was in the movie. That was the reason given. I remember that now. What? <laughs> uh, uh, because they said Patrick Star was topless. That's the reason. <laughs> uh, 
they're consistent with their stupid body standards. <laughs> it's inappropriate to show the male starfish with his <laughs> starfish chest hanging out. <laughs> when, need Patrick to go outside. Too, when Patrick is too loose, people need to go. <laughs> anyway, she's about to pull a gun on her brother. Back at you, at your back and call, just like it, it was back when. What? No. Screw you, Andrew. Don't act like I'm the bad guy here. You're, but you are both very abusive and awful people. I've never once made you do anything, but it's always I don't want to. I don't want to with you. Well, answer me this. What do you want then? Well, see, if you had listened to what I said, you know I. Why don't you want to spend time with me anymore? I've done nothing but spent time with you for the past three months. She says, seriously, someone get those kinds of people a hobby. <laughs> make model planes. Play with model train. Collect stamps. Make a ship in a bottle. Do something. I love the fact that all of the, uh, the suggestions Chu had are, like, stereotypically, like, older hobbies. Mm -hmm. Like, pre-video games hobbies. <laughs> So then, why? Aren't we friends anymore? Possibly. What the f- what? Of course- uh, of course we are. Just... <laughs> Those this. are the least harmed. Those, uh, Chu says, those are the least harmful because it keeps them away from the internet. That's the goal. Valid. Valid. No, wait, give them, uh, get, if it's video games, give them nothing but older consoles that don't have internet support. Get, 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 soon, soon to include the fucking, uh, Wii U and 3DS. No more internet. But anyway, only Pong for them. No, they have to play the earliest version of Pong, like that that Pong game that came out in like the 30s. Atari. <laughs> okay, just why? Yes, go. No, answer me. What were you about to say? Stay then. I'm going. Oh, no, you don't. What's so bad? <laughs> <laughs> What's so bad about me? I've been looking out for you. Isn't that what siblings do? Just stop. What? Talk to me. Talk to me, Andrew. Yeah. 
It's not my fault. It's uh, <laughs> <Jesus. laughs> I didn't lock us in here. I didn't kill the cultist. I didn't even kill the warden. Which one? <laughs> Neither. You did and the demon. <laughs> IQ, IQ is draining. Someone do something. No, Chu. You must suffer. You yeah. must suffer alongside us. I have a feeling the demo's about to end. I'm all incest. Oh, well, I'm all innocent. I've not harmed a single soul. Of course not. You make me do it for you. I didn't make you do shit, Andrew. <coughs> you chopped the bastard up all by yourself. And you chose to do everything you done here. And guess what, Andy? Don't. Uh. So now suddenly we're bringing that back up. You chose to lock bitch in that crate. Where the fucking punch choked? <laughs> Cry yourself to sleep so that... Cry yourself to sleep to that, Andy. My poor Andy. That... That just Purpose. came out of your mouth. Chu says proposal. They both die and the entire planet benefits. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This game is like a fucking train wreck. Yeah. But like, but like, not in the way that I think that it's bad. I, I think that it's accurately depicting just an incredibly abusive relationship. And that's the train wreck we're watching. Worst soap drama. <laughs> Damn, she escalated so much there. Yeah. And obviously, we can take forever to analyze everything that's going on here because, I mean, quite literally, uh, Ashley, oh my god, holy fucking shit. Ashley is Gaslight Gatekeep Girl Boss. <laughs> she gaslights. She gate keeps other women away from her from her brother because she's weird about her brother. And she's girl boss. I don't think she's girl boss, but she's gaslight and gate keep. Not even a soap drama. It's the worst kind of emo kid melodrama. Ha <laughs> What? It's true. You chose to do it. And you chose me. You chose me. Me. You backpedaling fuck of a brother. You chose me. You did. You did. Oh, ah. shit. Uh-oh. So, I guess we're now living here together. You can't do it. <laughs> Just say shit, fuck, cock, and other vulgar things, and you've got an interesting story somehow. <laughs> You won't. You can't, because I'm the only one you can talk to. Festus, stop yelling. Stop it. I'm busy. Fuck you. 
abusive relationships. That's this. When you can't sleep. Oh, fucking hell. You good? Tech issues on my end. Uh, the uh, HDMI cord doing a thing where it gets unplugged. <laughs> Chu said. Chu says, "Fucking finally, don't listen, Andrew. You can talk to the voices. Do it." <laughs> listen, I I've spent a number of a, a decent bit of time simping for Ashley. But yeah, I kind of agree. Yeah. Okay. To be, to, also, well, to be fair, this is Bryce's character. This is the, Ashley's the character that Bryce playing. I, unless like there's like a demon br brings her back or something, I don't see. I'm well, killing her. the item? Yeah. Uh, do it. <laughs> Choose turning into Palpatine. Yeah. Anyways, go ahead, Hatchet. When you can't sleep at night, and you can't take it, I'm the only one who can make it go away. And then also please stop. Fancy that, when you're the reason I can't sleep in the first place. Uh, Bookworm says, or this could all be a switch to playing as Andrew for a bit. Um, oh, <laughs> I would like to go now with Andy. I'm ready to go now. Go like Redacted did? Of course not. I want to leave this apartment before we get caught. With you. Can we go? I'd like to go too, but the thing is, you're pissing me off so much right now. We go now, and you'll just throw another fit later. <laughs> Not even going to deny it this time. Yeah, yeah I probably will. I'll make such a scene to... Yeah, so I don't know if I can risk it. Maybe I'll just end you here and be done with it. But if you can come up with a compelling reason not to, I won't. Chu says no one stopped me. I'm manifesting my desired outcome. <laughs> well, I already said... <coughs> <coughs> There are sleeping pills for that. Yeah, okay, I got nothing. But I'd like to go with you very much. Though, if you plan on ditching me anyway, then fuck you. Oh my... Mm. If it's not going... If it's not going to be just the two of us, then forget it. Ah. I don't... give a shit about bitch. I'm glad... <laughs> yeah. Worst timeline. <laughs> Give a shit about bitch. I'm glad she choked. <coughs> I know you are. Uh... No one knows it was us. So what does it matter? As long as it's just us. Are you saying you'll behave? I'll behave if you behave. Isn't that how it goes? Who knows with you? 
that I'm assuming we're getting out of here in the first place. <laughs> That's right. Our quest continues. What did we name this episode again? Andy and... Okay, but I'm not going to be Andy anymore. Huh? He's so spineless. And I hate Lele like you wouldn't believe. She says, I'm not angry. I'm just livid and disappointed. <laughs> Manifestation failed. Huh? <laughs> She better stay and die here with Andy. So you and I can leave. Fine. Whatever that means in this. I like you, but you're so exhausting. Nonsense. I'm in bigger <laughs> Let's leave and never revisit this conversation. Yes, I've got the keys to the second floor, and also the warden's gun. <laughs> she doesn't shut <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't shoot me yet. <laughs> Maybe later. <laughs> Let's get out of here, Andrew. Oh my god, how long is this fucking demo? Oh. But we can't read the... the no? We're not allowed to read how long, the no. I was gonna ask, how long were you planning to stream? About 2 a.m. or so. Okay. Ah, look, an open window. Hooray, Jim. Tempt, tempt me not, Andrew. I mean, it is only the second floor. She says the demo is supposedly 60 minutes long. Bullshit. <laughs> it's just being dragged out. I mean, yeah, that's true. It takes it takes longer when you a read slowly, b have a shit tons of distractions, and c have bright in the room. Fuck you. You really don't want to take your chances with that. <laughs> Book says, "OMG, we got so much content out of this." There we go. Damn it! Isn't there like a router or something we could use to climb down? Use the plant. Watch that actually be the answer. <laughs> oh. Can I try these rooms here? I think maybe there was a row of... Uh, oh. I just, I just combined rope and room and turned it into Rome. I think there's a rope up in that lady's room. Maybe. Oh, we never went in here. Alright, check. There's nothing there. Snooping around a lady's bathroom, were you? Uh... I had to wash her blood off of me. Oh, right. Excuse us about that. Thanks. Say so someone gave up assembling their furniture. A nail gun. Oh, we can't take the nail gun. Dead as stone. Nope. I guess check back in y'all's room. Wait, can we go in here? No. Did you try going in through your front door? 
I'm guessing you can't, but... <laughs> this is all it took to keep us in a wooden board. Uh, it's okay, Eddie. I don't have much muscle either. Yeah, I say you're trying to comfort me, but your words do the opposite. Ah, uh, whatever. What's this slip of paper say? The paper slip taped on the door reads 2XAB. What's that supposed to mean? Don't know. Don't care. Yeah, let's just focus on getting out of here. Maybe it's on the fuck bed. <laughs> Why would there be a rope on the fuck bed? Do I need to answer that hatchet? Oh, fuck <laughs> Do I need to answer uh. that question? <laughs> what one answer? Chew. Uh. <laughs> like, come on, Hatchet. You know what? This time I'm gonna do it. Oh, this, this is an old drawing. <laughs> huh? How dare you laugh at- how dare you laugh at my artistic genius. She says I wasn't listening because I was trying to suppress this laugh. <laughs> Bright made a joke about BDSM, and then, uh, Adurna described it as chew. Yeah. <laughs> to be fair, it would be chew- yeah, okay. Yeah, to, to, yeah, to be fair, yeah, Chu did like score. If I remember correctly, let me let me make sure. One yeah, I, think Chu, I I remember Chu scoring high in rope bunny. Yeah. Anyway, the garbage you hold on to. Hey, I was proud of this one. Still am. Well, it is still the best thing you ever draw, uh, Jew. Why did I say draw, a Jew? I'll take that as a compliment. Hey. <laughs> Obviously not there. Sends a patch of lawn grass in the mail. <laughs> take it outside and touch it. The freezer is full yeah. of delicious meat. Yum, oh, yeah. yum, yum. <laughs> oh, yeah, Hatch. Huh? Um, she got an 86 on that, so yeah. Yeah, so <laughs> tie your clothes together to make a rope. Did y'all miss what the freezer said? Yeah, uh, yes, we saw what the freezer said. Oh yeah, wait, couldn't you use that rope on that bed or something? No. Oh. I guess I check my the cultist unpaid. house. Oh wait. I I see rope. It's that weird rectang snake like thing up there. Oh yeah, maybe. But I, I hit enter a key, nothing's happening, so it doesn't count. Yeah. I mean there is a bunch of boxes here. Don't can't look at them. Yeah. Why are you checking the dead guys for rope? Why wouldn't you check dead guys for While well, look, looting a pocket, jacket pockets, you find a wallet with $666.66 inside. Now you got a real moral dilemma here. Stealing a dead man's wallet, will you keep it all or split it with Andrew? <laughs> I'll have Chu decide. Well, it's 666, so it makes- it, it would be funny to keep it all, but... Well, you have you would have it be between you, so I would say split it. 
666 between you. I have in choo choos. You're living in the same fucking house. Just split it, okay. Aw, oh, aren't you just sweet, huh? I'll use some of mine to treat you something someday, maybe. What, what the f- wait, wait, wait. What was that star above her head? Don't worry about it. I guess like an exclamation thing, sort of. Sort of nonsense. Plus 333 is the angel's number. Well then we really screwed up, because neither of these characters deserve that number. There's nothing on the fourth floor. Maybe the angels will come and smite them, please. Didn't we already check in here? Yeah, but I'm just double checking. What game is she playing? Can't tell. It's on a CRT TV. So it has to be something to do with the second floor. Shouldn't you, be, shouldn't you be able to get those, like, boards off? You should be able to, but it's not giving the option. The elevator's out of order. How could you tell? So, I don't know what the fuck to do. You think this is actually where the demo ends? You think it just stops here? Hold on. Jeeve says Loaf is asleep. Hush, little chew, Loaf, don't say a word. Uh, oh my god. Adurna, you've finished that song. I don't wanna. Oh my god. Now there's an yeah. actual ending. Oh. Chew says, no singing, small mouse hissing. Chew, you, well, actually, Chew, were you here earlier when I was singing Hurt? Hush, little Chew Loaf, don't you cry. By the end of this, I'm sure Ashley will die. Oh, are you gotta be fucking kidding me? Chew says I was only partially listening. Was it super obvious or something? Why? <laughs> you you at no point thought to check the long ass carpet. <sighs> yeah, we're what almost we... right at the end, by the way. We're right uh, there. <laughs> what if we really gone. For real. Shut up. What if we climb down the window using this carpet? Shut up, Xbox. I'm busy. I'm not sure how we're going to secure it, though. You will hold it while I descend. Oh, yeah, and I'll just dump jump into your arms once you're down. Would that actually work? 
Maybe if you catch me instead? Hell no, it yeah. won't. We've got to set up something to hold the cop in place while we climb down. Nail gun. Yeah. Well, let's leave it by the window for now. Uh... Got carpet. Oh, okay. I, I, I didn't say anything with the fucking board, but with the carpet. It's happened twice now that an object in the environment is clipping outside of the fucking borders of the room. Why? Why Don't is the carpet doing it. that? It happened also with the board you pried off of your door. The two of you used the nail gun to nail the carpet onto the wall. It doesn't look safe. Oh shit. There has, has got to be something else. I'm going for it. Go on. If, if nothing else, maybe the carpet slows my descent down. I or mean, I guess. <sighs> Alright, you first then. Damn right I go first. I am a lady. Please you fall. You climb down Please, very unladylike. <laughs> So, what happens now? Well, what happens now is that we'll skip town and then find a buffet restaurant. Oh. Then we'll steal someone's identity or something to continue our lives. Easy peasy, huh? And then, as long as we never come in contact with the law enforcement, We'll live a quiet life and die. You got it all figured out. Good God, I have no idea what we're going to do, Ashley. First things first, skipping town and the buffet. Let's go to a real touristy location. Maybe some traveler will drop their ID. Then we'll rent a place using that. I'm sure we'll find some front work somewhere, too. I... even then, I don't think that's going to. Shut your mouth! Shut your mouth! We'll all work out, lest we'll live, on, live under a bridge or something. Like trolls. We'll eat those who won't pay the toll to cross. <laughs> How can you laugh? It's anything but funny. How can you do anything else but laugh? Everything has gone to crap. <laughs> <laughs> Keep it together. I am. Let's start by catching a bus. Deploys the cricket. I'm happy. I'm happy to be out of there, too. And otherwise? I'm a hair away from a panic attack, thanks for asking. I didn't get to tell you before, but the friend I called while you were downstairs gave me a gift. Do I even want to know? Supposedly, I should be seeing visions of the future in my sleep now. But who knows? Well, I hope you do. It would be handy when it comes to avoiding certain things. Yep, so can you relax a bit? I'll keep my sleeping eyes open. But that also means you can't leave me now. You're stuck with me. Nothing new under the sun. Duck, huh? Are you? 
Oh yeah, completely stuck. This is a challenge. Hey. <laughs> you get on the bus and drive the hell out of there. Wait, we we drove the bus? <laughs> We just hijack a bus. <laughs> Wait, and the bus is coming to a quarantined area? Right. <laughs> okay. I mean, they have a gun, that is true. Vroom, vroom, motherfucker! <laughs> we made it through the first episode. episode When I save or something, it carries over to the full game. Oh. <laughs> Fuck no, I'm not coming back. I think... Now, if I, if I remember it correctly, I think I gave the guy like... Alright. I think I gave him that kind of voice, if I remember correctly. Um, I can't remember. Some... I feel something like that more nasally and less tired sounding. Right. Well, I can just double check real quick. <laughs> yeah. Damn, you should have done that. But while I was being late. Shut up. Now who's late, huh? You. No, we're both late. <laughs> That's how this works. There it is. But yeah, I'm kind of excited because once I get that new graphics card, I'm probably going to consider actually trying out streaming on my own channel. Neat. I see the botting still going on. Oh no, the voice I gave him was, I guess I lost some brand cells too. That was the, that was the voice I gave him. Oh yeah, yeah. That's, that sounds about right. Okay. You are finishing up what's left of your lunch. The consequences of your actions have yet to catch up with you, which is nice. Let's see, I gave her the Cindy voice, right? Yeah. Um, there's nothing interesting in the paper, right? And that done reading. It's been a week. The odds that there is something now are non-existent. That's not... Ashley. <laughs> I love you, but that's not how this works. <laughs> right. Just then, check. Uh, I'm bored. Oh my god, she's gonna burn the paper. <laughs> how much longer can we stay here anyway? We're almost out of money. Technically, I have money. I just can't use it without giving away where I am to the bank. So, no money then. 
I also love how the restaurant's called Eat Food. <laughs> I didn't even notice that. You there! Eat food! <laughs> now! $25! <laughs> food poisoning not guaranteed! <laughs> I would love that to be a slogan for a restaurant. That would be amazing. <laughs> it's just like, I, I get that idea from a uh, Quentin Review's most recent video, to my knowledge, where he tells a story about him eating a chicken sandwich from a place that he's never been to in Ohio, and uh, he's eating the sandwich, and it's like a buffalo chicken melt thing, and he mentions thinking it's odd. Uh, he, he mentions thinking it's odd that they, for some reason, put sauerkraut into this sandwich, oh. but it wasn't sauerkraut, oh. and like, like, 40 minutes later, he's projectile vomiting, and, uh, he mentioned at the end of the entire story that, and you know what? I didn't even complain. I spent $17.90 some- I, I spent $17 and something something cents to get food poisoning. <laughs> He's like, I didn't even complain. I supported a small local business. But anyway. And I don't get why they want to check my ID for every fucking thing. Okay, that actually is odd for a bank to do. Well, I don't think that I, I don't know if this is talking about the bank thing or more just like everything they're doing. Oh, yes, yeah, everything yeah. they're doing. <laughs> like, goddamn, yeah. I just want to stay at a hotel. Why do I? Have, why do you need to know who I am? I'm paying up front, aren't I? So it's not like I bail out. I bail out, out on them. Fucking got some real fucking authoritarian shit going on here. Yep. Smell it. Boo. Oh, uh, the motel is just fine too. Uh. It's really not. I swear, I heard gunshots last night. That's or was normal. that just you? Wait, what? What would Ashley be doing that makes you think she's making gunshot sounds? I mean, they do have a gun. Oh yeah, right, I forgot about that. <laughs> I haven't shot anything... ...yet. <laughs> the smug face. <laughs> You see, I'm having an issue here, because, like, with with all of the implied incest thus far, like, implied and very clear emotional incest that's come up, like, that's all we have here. But I've been on Twitter, and I've been seeing so much fucking art. Oh my god, Hatchet. Not say for work art, specifically. Oh my god. So my brain is slightly broken right now. <laughs> Can I hit the enter key? <laughs> She's like, what the fuck? You're looking at my nose? <laughs> oh, I hate myself. <laughs> I said... What? I think I left my gun back in the row. Girl. You dumbass. Uh you Anyway. Oh yeah. 
They, uh... They recently changed the sword law in my state. Is this something you've mentioned? No. Before? Basically, okay, it I'll... states... Um, Go ahead. You don't need a permit or license if the sword or knife is 12 inches or shorter. Again, this is so stupidly arbitrary. And you can also carry it out with you. The cops won't like it, but it's legal. Let's see, 12... Fucking... So, so it can't be longer than a foot? Yeah. Okay. Which is literally most swords are longer. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Again, the this is that it's so stupid. Literally, all those laws do is hit hobbyists. Yeah. That's it. That's all they hit. Ev like, like, ha like, is there actually a problem in Virginia of people going out <laughs> with fucking great swords and katanas and fucking <laughs> dueling in the streets and hacking random people up? I think not. I mean, obviously, why, Hatchet why? the Yakuza is definitely in, in, in Virginia, not Japan, obviously. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> you know what? Maybe there should be, like, deranged Virginians out there running around with fucking long swords, hacking people up. Maybe that should be a thing. Yeah, instead of Florida Man, is Virginia Man. <laughs> Virgin <laughs> Virginia Man caught dismembering local politician <laughs> with great sword. Okay, so real quick, I'm going to deafen in Discord and listen to the stream in, like, Twitch to check on the music. Yeah. Okay, sounds pretty reasonable. Okay. I really wish you'd be uh, less nonchalant about everything all the time. Hey now, we can't both be constantly shitting ourselves over every little thing. True, let's get back to the motel before someone breaks in and steals a damn thing. Also, who the fuck is this woman over here? It is Lady McWoman Face. Not people. Are you looking for anything specific? Nah, just window shopping. Uh, oh, in that case, may I interest you in leaving me the fuck alone? <laughs> Okay, I'm glad I talked to them. <laughs> I like this lady. <laughs> yeah. I'm assuming that's our room. <laughs> There's just a random bra on the ground. Seems normal. Oh my gosh, I actually had to pick it up! <laughs> <laughs> There's an article about a chemical leak in some city you've never been to. Narco details instructions for people in, in the area to stay home and seal their windows. Hazmat workers will be sent to rescue people block by block. I have a feeling that's how they got the people in the hotel to, like, take their blood and stuff. Hmm. Andrew has been hoarding newspapers ever since you arrived. from a few days ago, there's nothing worthwhile written on it. 
Paper isn't even comfortable enough to wipe your ass with. All in all, a total waste of money. Oh, I have to pick up my clothes. I suppose I should throw these in the washer while I still can. So where's the goddamn gun? The closet is empty except for... Re reclaim oh, your there. gun. You just... You just put a... <laughs> she just put a single gun in an otherwise entirely empty closet. <laughs> yeah. No, it's not really yours anyway, but whatever. The warden's gun is yours now. You throw the laundry in the washer. Is it at all commonplace for a motel to have a washing machine in their bathroom? Because I, I thought for sure that they would have like a separate area where you go to wash stuff. Um, from what I've seen, uh, it's usually really expensive hotels to have washers and dryers in their in their rooms, like the Hyatt or something like that. But yeah. like not so well known hotels, no, that that they'll be separate. Hmm. Oh my gosh, this would be perfect for Laffy. <laughs> it's TV and says, "Hey you." <laughs> I mean, okay. Wait, do you want oh, to were you meaning, were you meaning my Laffy or your Laffy? Oh, I was meaning your Laffy. I, I, I kind of oh, okay. wanted to hear because you said you wanted to voice Laffy. Okay. <laughs> let me, let me just think for a sec. Okay. Hey, you! I, I'm a fucking rabbit. <laughs> Aren't you tired of drinking the same old water every day? Yeah, it's so... Yeah, it's so wet. Are you serious? I think that's the fucking point. Water. Water. Have you... Have you tried Toxic Soda? Wait, that's going into the Halo voice. No, not that. I'm Lap. No, that's not right. Oh no. I'm Laffy McLafferson. I like it's it's hard to like put it into words because I want it to sound very announcer esque, but it needs to be separate from my Halo announcer voice. And ladies and gentlemen, we have you tried Toxy Soda? It's what? <laughs> it's water, but were. Now in three new flavors. I swear, if, if all the flavors are labeled poisons, I'm gonna laugh. What? Awful. Gross and nasty. Try them today. Yeah, I feel like that has poison in it. Just laugh. Mmm, -mm, toxy soda. Tastes like life. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in the very last moments of it. <laughs> It tastes awful. I don't, <laughs> I don't know why I'm drinking this. Listen, listen, hear me out. That advertisement would 100% convince me on at least trying that soda. <laughs> <laughs> There's no pillow. Leave it to Andrew to insist on getting a room with two separate beds. 
only to then have a panic attack every other night. Jesus Christ, poor Andrew. 